I'm Cynthia Mulligan in Sudbury, Ontario, where there is going to be an unprecedented moment in provincial politics in recent memory. Tomorrow, Premier Kathleen Wynne is going to be testifying on the, in a courthouse on the second floor of this building. Now, she is going to be testifying in a by-election bribery scandal. Two top Liberals, uh, in fact, one of them is Wynne's former chief of staff, and the other is Jerry Lougheed, a very uh, well-known provincial liberal fundraiser here in Sudbury and they are charged with trying to bribe a would-be candidate into not running in a provincial by-election in Sudbury in 2015 so that their preferred candidate now Energy Minister Glenn Thibault could run instead both are denying the charges but you have to remember at the same time another trial started yesterday and that's to do with another scandal and two former Dalton McGinty liberal staffers are facing charges related to deleted emails in the cancelled gas plant scandal. So the two combined make very bad optics for Premier Kathleen Wynne at a time where it's just over eight months before the next election. And she has just been abysmal in the polls. And it feeds into the opposition narrative that this is a corrupt government that has to go. Now, the upside for Kathleen Wynne is it's still several months before the election and voters may forget all about this before they go to the polls or by the time they get to the polls. And also, don't forget, she's a very very skilled debater. She's good on her feet. She's used to debating with the opposition and with the media. So I bet she's counting on the fact that she can hold her own uh, in that trial. We'll be uh, seeing all it unfolds tomorrow. I'll be live tweeting from the courthouse and give you the very latest here from Sudbury.